Anyways, welcome back to my video. Today, we're playing the Millennium Mondad. As you can see by the title, we're playing as Taiwan, and we're trying to recapture the old territories, and uh, re... Uh, re... In, replace... no, fuck. Like, uh, put in charge the monarchist. Fuck, I'm so sad because... <laughs> I just gotta tell this now in the beginning. Um, I was going to do this video yesterday, and then I saw another YouTuber upload this exact thing. But he didn't do the one important thing that I feel is important and event that is to do monarch. He did something else, I don't know what, but he's not monarchist and then it's not fun because the whole point is you don't want this to be a republic, you want to re yeah, you want to put uh, yeah, reinstall. Yeah, reinstall. That's a good word. Reinstall the monarchist in this land. So he missed that and I'll try to do that. To be a bit different at least, but hey, I'm going to do quite a bit similar I think I have no I haven't even watched the video I just seen it put up and I was like super mad because I wanted because before I uploaded uh, before I saw his video I was like yeah this is such a good idea and uh, yeah it seems someone else has taken it but I know the basic setup now with this nation I know what the division you have and stuff and it seems like you're in a very good place to either use artillery or tanks, because this mechanized is just, it's, is it a light, only light? No, some mechanized and light, okay, that's interesting. It's a big division. I'm gonna switch this out to armored. Uh, it depends though what, armored. You have light, 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 only light. So you will even just, you can just skip out on normal. Mechanized, I think, let's see. Mechanized, if I do that, the speed is the same, we get more soft attack, less hard attack, oh, less air attack, I don't like that. Oh, more of these though, okay, but it's, yeah, we should probably switch out one or two, so we'll, we'll actually produce that. And for infantry, we'll really switch that one out, but at least it's a lot of stuff. So here, we have a couple different things. This is us, but uh, it has a lot of factories, so that's good, but we can't build anything. Well, so what you want to build is... He did this as well. You should just build the radio. <laughs> I'll stop doing stuff like he did, but I just felt like this was quite a smart idea because everything else is maxed. You have anti-air or radar station, and I feel the radar station. If I don't know if it has good range, hopefully it can reach over here and get good intel. If not, well, fuck, then it's a waste of time. I just hope it does. Um, just okay. And here you always want to do the two industry, and you always, most of the time, if it's one of these two you want to do in uh, Millennium Dawn, and it depends. If you have a big military with loads of artillery, you want to go down here, pick, uh, probably pick this burst. Yeah, you should probably pick this burst uh, in Millennium Dawn and Shock and Awe. And if you go down Blitzkrieg, it depends. You sometimes want to go down right, sometimes left. And depending if you need the military left, otherwise right. I'll probably not need the military, but we'll see. Oh, we're already unlimited and we don't have that good army, 350,000 is not that good for the limited. Fuck, that's not good. Okay, we'll continue doing research. So I decided for this. It seems to be the best. You don't really have a lot of stuffs to work with, mostly civilians. So we we'll, we are going to convert because we have nothing else to do after this is completed. We'll we'll convert here. Convert. Start converting them over to the right. <laughs> what I want them to be. I rarely use a convert thing, but uh, in this case it seems it's going to be useful. And uh, I'm going to try to do it as quick as possible, but uh, we'll do probably around 20 to 30 minute episodes as usual and should be good. So, what I'm thinking here in the beginning is we don't need to go down military here, because, and absolutely not, <laughs> we have the ones here. So, what you have to do, the openers for this mod is really just industry here, here, and just rush down for this one for free and get these two because these are good and uh, but they take a lot of time that's the thing but uh, so that's one opener if you have a bad industry I recommend that if you uh, well I don't think this is a good opener but if you really want the like good bonuses these are the bonuses you're looking for and the stability here is kind of good but we're already on high stability which is uh, what you want to be partially recognize this oh I'm only partial shit Okay, either way, you're on high. You don't really want to get high. Well, you're going to get higher with uh, events and such, but I'm not going to look for it because I don't need it. If I was at low, yeah, I would definitely try to pick up stability, but hey. And here, this is where you pick up, uh, for in our case, monarchist. And you don't really want that because you decrease your stability 
and the only big bonus you get for actually switching is the weekly national unity and justification of war. And what is important here is just uh, the weekly national unity, because this allows us to get up to high taxes. Because what you want is always try to get as high taxes as possible, but it actually gives minus national unity, which is really bad. But if you have a bonus which uh, contradicts that, you don't actually get a lot of negative effects. So that's what we're going to do. Aim for getting it onto their high taxes and getting um, uh, the value of old. And uh, at the time we're doing that, that will probably expand into resources down here. What I'm, I don't know what's the worst enemies. I have quite a bit, but I have more, but the thing is I need to land as well. I need to make a landing somewhere. And somewhere where they are weak. I could probably take v Singapore out, but they wouldn't give me anything really. Indonesian state, are you good? Yeah, you're powerful compared to me right now. Papua New Guinea. Yeah, they're weak. Papua New Guinea, but don't have anything, so it's not, well, good in that case. Oh, guaranteed quick. Then that's not a good idea. We don't want to get the Americans involved in anything. I'll start. Like, it's. Are you strong, really? No, but uh, do you have anything for me? No, but it would allow me to take out the others. So maybe the, you're a, good, a better idea. But you have such a small here, and do you have any ports even? Don't can't see any. It's very, very risky, I suppose. Probably better to go for Malaya. What is this? Is it Malaysia? Yeah, Malaysia. And pick up, take them out. Because they have a lot of resources. Oh, their resources are good. And it would allow me to both invade this guy here and in here. And those are the ones I want, really. Oh, but maybe I could just skip a middle hand 8 to 17, 8 to 16. You have less on everything, though. Because. Oh god, you're and low stability or average stability. Steady birth rate. Okay, you have quite a good, uh, quite a lot of negative effect compared to you. So maybe it's better going for Thailand, attacking them. We have a lot of navels I can do, probably. I want a port though, so where do we have ports? Well, nowhere except the capital, which they will be defending. So we'll see what I choose. But I think I'm going to go down here st at the start. And for here, you're gonna pick something from this. It's not really important. You will, you'll need to do it though. So here we do modern equipment and uh, do some other stuff. Wait one minute. Okay, sorry for that. And the standard, those three are the most important. After that, it's probably the tank. Probably. Mm, the thing is, yeah, we really want the resources to go for this one first. Compared to above ones under. But we don't actually have any resources either way. <laughs> but still. So we'll train these two, one of each. It's fine. Have a reinforcement on highest, so it's probably not going to build anything. You can basically choose whatever you want to build. But probably best to do the destroyer because it's cheapest. Probably. Here, capital. Trading. How many am I building with seven? So I can not. I would really wanted five at least. So you can trade for with Japan. Yeah, it's fine. What do I need for gun support? Yeah, it seems I need it at least one. I'll trade as little as possible. Yeah, it should be good. New Security Council members. Cool. And we will pick our best general, of course, because why wouldn't you? And, uh, oh, actually, Philippines. Mm -hmm -hmm. Not really strong. Quite good of resources. Ca kind of a lot of resources, I'm seeing. Okay, let's say we invade here. Get this lockdown. It's 14 divisions that can pretty easily spread out and take it push down here should surrender we see this right one one fifteen one so that's fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen and he's at seventy five and it's basically nothing down here
Okay. Yeah. Sorry for that. <laughs> Family stuff. People get home after school, like me. I got home early today. <laughs> now, sister's home. Sad. Okay. So what choices do we have? It's this guy. I really think it's Malaysia or Philippines at this point. What does Philippines? They don't get, allow me to expand more, and I sometimes I need to get in here because I need to. I really want this uh, front line. I need a front line. I also want to do navels. I want to probably secure this island from them early. Probably secure this here from them. Because like they are really strong, and if I will ha ever have a chance, I'll need basically probably half their units. Mm, half is that workers right you always want if you get this event the workers right is the best because you get stability so i'll probably fifth somewhere between 50 and 70 i'm thinking to have a, re a high chance of winning because it's a bot like you can't really <laughs> and millennium dawn they're especially bad i feel like probably not true they will be 10 they will be 6 okay 10 is better than 6 Oh, that means I should switch my boats to start there, so we have at this home base from the beginning. Yeah. We'll do that naval. I think that's a good naval order. Like this, aggressive, of course. I usually do aggressive. I don't sure if it if it is the best or not, but hey, I really think it's it feels better at least just being aggressive, especially in early game. So we'll do this conquer take this land and I like what they, uh, that they changed in uh, in Millennium Dorm that these things doesn't really cost that much you can do a lot actually before you start kicking in like uh, negative what the fuck like 25% you really want to keep under that and a bit under because event random events and shit and it goes down quite quick I feel like it's quite hard to get it up uh, hmm, maybe we want colonies, so we can, oh god, I need a lot of boats, right, for naval, we don't have any, cool, cool, so after here, maybe we can take Sri Lanka, depends though if India is guaranteeing them, fuck yeah, Yo. shit, I hate you India, but I'm thinking maybe Somalia, Saudi Arabia, getting good, good stuff, Maybe, no, just Oman should be good, and then into Saudi. They're pretty strong though, I would, no, not really. I would like to do a Saudi Arabia game to where it <laughs> uh, reform like the Arabian thing or something. Mm, maybe. Would be kind of cool, I suspect. We don't need to pick that. I've realized it's n it doesn't, it's not necessary. You just skip it. Pick the military furious, it's they buffed him. We buffed them so much, minus 10%, that's a good bit of research time if you think all of these down. So you want to pick it up as soon as possible, really. Okay, other stuff that's happening. Is this radio done soon? Also, I should probably not have done the radio and just always convert it, but hey. Okay, now we have a radio, now we can see. Can we see? I don't know. I don't know, man. Can go into electronics and see what it does. No. What? Ah, here. You need to enemy troops in nearby states. Higher range. Oh, okay. It's like. It doesn't say how much range it has, though, which was what I was looking for. Hmm. Hopefully, it turns out to find this game. <laughs> I let's see when it's done. 2000. Okay, that's good. At the first year, we can have our first expansion. Get up after this. I'll get up into Thailand. Take that. Get up into probably these two before attacking Vietnam, because Vietnam is so so <laughs> hard to attack if you. If I, maybe I'll take only here, and I need to attack all the way through up here. So much attrition. Then it's better. If I only take Laos, I don't know if he would surrender by taking this. Then it's better taking those, both of these, even it costs more for attention. Push in at the same time to reach two points, and it should be good. Okay, what do you have here? I like this one, but it's, <laughs> it's actually not that good compared to 
this one, but I still I do it before for some reason. I don't know. Probably not that important. No, it's not because I'm not going to war in time. Hey, okay, still. Okay, producing. I have stuff. Two a year. Oh god, that's not good. Two a year is not good. Good enough. Also, wars. No, none of them are actually useful. Kinda, but hey. Another thing. I just realized this one is you need to pick this up sometime. It's so good. Recruitment strategies. Yeah, work the strike. Whoop. Whoop whoop. Ah, now I'm making more properly. Faster. I should be. Because I don't have work your strike thing. Oh well. Doesn't. Fish mm, output. Basic industrial. That's a lot of bonuses. Like, you have to start with game plus 50% factor output, huh? Growth. Don't really have a lot to do right now. <laughs> Is this Chinese Islands? Oh god. Hmm. I have flames on everything, that's good. It's like when we take core. It should be quite easy to just. It doesn't cost more because you retake horse. Really? Oh well. Major nationalist try uh, rally. We don't want to be nationalist, we want to be monarchist. Because that's much more swag as China. Hopefully on this video I have made a cool thumbnail. I'm gonna try to do it. It's fun making thumbnails actually, of course. If I have a cool topic, so I'll see who the last uh, what it's called, Emperor was, and <laughs> probably had Adam in the thing. Oh right, this is what I should fuck. I should not have researched this stuff. I'm so dumb. This is so much more important. Shit, 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 shit. Because <laughs> you need good military stuff if you want to have a chance. Uh, like if I'm going to be a lot less than China, I will need better everything, better troops, more, more. Like not reserves, but stockpile stuff. You better bonuses. The advantage and surprise. <laughs> the Spanish Inquisition. Angola is claimed by me. Good. I'm also claiming this one. <laughs> so that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to try actually. <laughs> oh god, but I can't take town too. Then I need to go to war with Russia. Right, I can do that and only take that profit. <laughs> We'll see about that. Let's talk about that. A lot of references in, in this episode, but that's part of it, I guess, in coming back. Like, I've been doing other stuff. But a lot of fun not doing YouTube. Also, it's a lot of fun doing YouTube, but still. It's been fun just not doing it for a while, because I did it uh, almost one year straight. <laughs> and that doesn't seem like a lot, but uh, for me it was a big part of everyday shit like thinking out what I want to do it's much more easy just playing a game than thinking out strategies and episodes I take a lot of time to do that so that's why I appreciate when people send in ideas and what I can do because it's much easier then because then I don't need to think I can just do what other people have suggested but uh, and I don't expect to get them so it's not like and I don't get them that often so it's like hmm I'll need to think of something today and uh, at some point I was like no I can't think of new ideas I'll just let my YouTube channel sit for a bit while we wait for the expansion to come out and I get some time to just relax okay what should we do now probably I'll really like this one because of the uh, construction speed and factor out. No, no, not the construction speed, only for civilian shit. That's. <laughs> it's not that good, man. For 150 pp. Not that long to war, so we'll probably pick up an offensive guy. Offensive, 5% not good. Reformer. No. No. That sucks. This sucks. Probably I'll pick up that. Just check down here. good enough. Where's my monarchy support? 
Taiwan will be the monarchist powerhouse. Hmm. Seems good. Seems good. Oh, I thought I'd start the game. So I'll see if I lose one here when I do it. Yeah, shit. Unlucky, I guess. Wait. Oh yeah, it's building. For it didn't. Building everything I need, probably. Okay, let's see if we have any naval guys. Yeah, we do. Oh, a level 2 on hype. That's awesome. Come on. Sweet. Yeah. Well, you, you will need probably certain. It depends. Does he have any boats? No, then we can probably just do escort. But if he has ships, you will need to search and destroy them before. Usually. Just does it want to do it? Don't want. <laughs> it, the naval vision won't happen if you don't have naval control and. If you get naval control, you're probably gonna need to destroy his fleet if he has one, and you do that by having search and destroy. Usually. Usually. Yeah, 17 days, that's nothing of wasted production, I don't care. If I'm wasting some days. We're take looking at the bigger picture here, dude. The boat's kinda weird, why? <laughs> China uh, monarchy would like to expand down here, but hey, I if I want to have a chance of China, I need to take out the weaklings. Don't mix that up with younglings, please. <laughs> okay, 20% I get from that, so yeah, 5%. That's 25% support, and the biggest one now has 40. We'll have around that much support. It's not a lot for being the main one. We can probably take our time going down here. Yeah, let's do that. Don't need to switch right now. I have stuff to do with PP that isn't moving up in uh, what's called Texas. So you can do stuff like going here probably. Should be able. For November, yeah, that's basically now. We'll do that, no ships right, 11 to 24, okay, we'll need to be quick then, if we want to have a chance. No fleet, no air force, hmm. Interesting, we'll see how things turn out. If I fail, this will probably not reach YouTube, so if you're watching this, it should succeed. Hopefully. Oh, actually, recon or log logistics. For a reason that we will do navels, and if we don't have a port, I will. Re I would really appreciate having some sort of um, logistical advantage. In that ten percent less, yeah, that's kind of good. Though they're not regulars, which is really bad, actually. It's a big deal. So maybe it's was worse doing that. I'm not sure. It's a one v one here. We are defending the ports. I'm seeing. I really don't like that we've answered by K. He won. Push. We'll check in on these when we how we do our naval. We don't seem to. Be, I want one to be doing down here. My God. Hopefully one does. If not, I can probably do it last second. I think I can do it. Yeah, he's doing down here. I need one or most, hopefully two more. Rip the navels. Call off the attacks. I should probably only do it down here. Come on. We should win this one. When it's like you're leading this much and. Uh, even though it says you're losing, you, you should be able to turn it around with some good luck. 
hopefully. And he has a general, it seems. Come on, and this is one of this is basically the best one you can succeed on. You should probably have done everything here then. In that case. If this is what I wanted to land on. Maybe I should do that. Oh, let's do the end of this stuff. Because everyone should have done it by this point, and uh, except me, <laughs> it seems. Okay. Come on. Come on. Offense. Help me out here. You never let me down before. I thought you could do that. Come on. You need to succeed. Not looking good for us. It's really not looking good. I'm not losing hope just yet. <laughs> Probably should. But it's a bot, come on. The logistics can't really be that good for him. He needs to. <laughs> we have been doing the siege for like one month. Trying to get get in land. It's so close. It's so close. Close quarters attack, close quarters defense. Come on. He's using the perfect defense. I need the initiative. If I get the initiative, I will probably win it. He has the decryption advantage. Shit, shit, that's a big deal actually. But I have so much more divisions. Come on. Come on, we get good gear now. We will get good gear. Gear. Please let us win. I'm a night vision, maybe that help. If I get it. Come on. Ouch, it's not looking good. Oh. Oh god, come on, we can do it. We can do it, boys. He should be weak on organization. No. No. Oh, come on. We can probably land now. Don't seem to be any units here. Yes. Come on. Oh, no. No other units. Okay, let's do everything on here. Six eight, eight days. That's not that much. Hopefully we can turn it. Hope. <laughs> but it votes not looking that good for us. No, we don't need that shit. We don't need anything. Oh well, encryption is fine, I guess. Okay, we have some. We have more troops now. And we're concentrating them more. And we get bonuses. Yippee. Turn up politics. Recruit more of these guys. Uh, it's the one year that's leading. Maybe we should wait, man. I don't want the support for it. Yeah, we can get the stability right. That's better. Stability is probably better. Here we get, should probably pick recon. Here we should get the logistics. I'm thinking. Oh, I've landed. 
if they can hold out, that would be insane. I don't think it can build it because they are being attacked. What the fuck? You shouldn't be able to. Oh well. Yeah, yeah, you can't, you can't. Losing divisions, boys. Oh god, maybe if we cut divisions here and do it quicker, that would be a good idea. Probably just add this on. No, these are just gonna die. I'll let them die. They'll never hold out. Rip. Okay, we'll do that, Naval. If it doesn't succeed, well, it's not going with YouTube. If it does, if it succeeds, well, it will be a bad victory, a really bad one. But I don't want to do it again. Cause it's not fun. Just restarting. But if I have to, I have to. Come on. The days. Why my computer is too slow? Come on! Game plays too slow. He can't do enables to me. Oh, he will have the uh, encryption advantage and decryption shit. Okay, 11 dudes concentrated for this one very important province that's hopefully not defended. And if it is, well, shit. That's shit then. Oh, closing in. Hopefully, we can do it. Yeah, we're winning at least. <laughs> Can't do a shit. We can do that, why not? Build something. We really, really don't want to convert more, that's a thing. I converted enough already. Industry too much. We went up to six though, now we're partial. God, I thought we would be favored. And we are probably probably favored. But it's hard to get a landing down, that's <laughs> I realize I have. And that's good. Yeah, at this point we should probably pick this up. Because I got them five from here and two from over. Yeah yeah yeah. Should probably not be decreased. Seems good. Decryption advantage, it's fine. Level 4 general, that's good, it's good. What we want. Come on. I can't be bothered. Level 1, okay, and level 4. Hmm. Good, we don't get those bonuses. Well, it's good and good, I mean. <laughs> it's like, I don't care. Really. But it doesn't matter. These seem to stay, though, for like ever. Which is bad, I think they should disappear after a year. I feel like that would be more fun because um, you sometimes you want a couple percentage in our ideologies like if you want to join Russia you need reactionary at least one percent so by that reasoning you will want at least some to be open so you can get some but where is reactionary yeah what does that do
Not that good. But that's one's good. That one's really good. Yeah, half a year, sure. Is that good? Yeah, that's good, that's good. That's what we want, so we can build more factories. Come on, we can do it. We can land, and we will send these 11 divisions and kill the other ones. Destroy them. Maybe we should have landed here, but then we won't surrender, so... Then there's no point, really. I guess. I will get a lot of factories, because I'll trade it away. I'll make sure I'm on free trade, am I? Nope. I'll get up. I'll move it up. <laughs> I want them factories, bro. Oh, maybe it's not necessary. Maybe we can just keep it here at export. Focus. <laughs> this episode is so long. Come on. Okay, we're winning. I'll probably... We'll see. Yep, finally. Okay, we won. That's good. Blue up here. Yeah, that's what I should have done from the beginning. So if you're trying to do this, yeah, that, learn that. that. That's a lot better. Yep, now we've killed those. Push, 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 push. We'll try and push. Yeah, you're moving up. You can take that city. I'll try to encircle this. Yeah, this is absolutely the best, just focusing on one. My bad, I didn't realize that I was dumb. Valley of all, that's why we're going down either, even. So there's no real reason to not rush it. And now, I have Hong Chang. Good. So I have actually a good leader I can trust on. A leader I can respect. They will run out of stuff to fight with. Yeah, so remove that border so people don't get confused. <laughs> if troops need a gold. Take it out. Good. Yes, they surrendered. Who I was kind of scared there. Okay, we annexed it. Now it's going up north. Up north, I aim. We don't need that. Do we? Yeah, we do. Sure. So, that's it for this long episode. <laughs> Sorry for fucking it up here. I. Well, I didn't do it by fault but <laughs> I lost stuff for it and I'll pay for it but I'll keep this here if I'm mistaken why not because I can't probably redo it but hey if you enjoyed the episode and want to see more leave a like down below tell me in the comments if you have any other suggestions and I'll see you guys next time bye